All right. Um, today I'm going to make a short videos about this circle two questions because yeah, because one of the students say this is PT three question. If this is PT three mean from three, I think it's it should be quite quite hard for some PT three student. Yeah, and obviously I will see the words hot over here. That's mean this is KBAT question. All right, and then I guess I have to. Yep. All right. So. Okay, let's have a look on this question. In the diagram, the length of the minor RLQ, I mean the LQ here, the length of LQ is four times the length of the minor R's, uh, FH. That's mean, if if the value here, uh, I call it, okay, if the FH over here, I call it K, then this one will be 4K. Okay, let me change other color. Yellow is just not so good here. It's just 4K and this is just K. Mean, yeah, their ratio is basically 4 and 1. Alright, so, and then basically they will tell you all of these are the straight line and find the value X, Y, and Z. Okay, what is uh, what is the purpose they tell you this uh, the art length actually is 4 times? Because basically the art length actually will affect the angle. So that's mean since they have the uh, x, y, and z already. So that's mean. Um, okay, let me add another la layer. That's mean if this angle, if this angle over here is w, I mean, yeah, and then the, this angle over here will be W over 4. Okay, I don't use W and W over 4 because it's quite confused. Okay, let's use the other thing. Okay, um, that's mean if I use this at length, if here I call it 4W, and, and for this at length, I mean H to F, this one over here is just W. I mean, this angle is just one. Uh, okay, the angle here QFL is just four times the angle of a HLF. Okay, this is what you you will need to see. Okay, so if you can see that, then the whole question it, it will not go too crazy, All right? So of course, the first thing I I will do over here is okay. We're trying to find the x here. All right, so. You understand if you have a circle over here and a quadrilateral inside the circle, so what will happen is the opposite angle plus together is always equals to 180. Okay, it's a quadrilateral inside the circle. Must make sure four corner also touch the circumference. Then the opposite angle, let's say this is uh, C and this is D. So we know the opposite angle plus together must equals to 180. So therefore, if this one is 70 over here, uh, I mean, this one is 110 here, I know here will be 70, right? So if here is 70, so I know 60 plus x is equal to 70, then x is just equal to 10. Then I can easily get my answer for x, which is 10. All right, so I will just uh, sort of write down the answer for x, x equals to 10 degree. All right. Then since we have the 10 here, so yeah, I will do some remark and then I think okay, I will say this is 10. Alright, then now we want to find a y. So basically you need to understand what I'm trying to say just now, which is the angle if F L H equals to 10, then because this art length over here is like 1 over 4 of this art length. Or we can say this uh, LQ is just 4 times of FH. So, I know this angle, because this is 10, right? This one will be 40 degree. Alright. Okay, I hope you basically you see that. Because both of them share the same straight line. Do, do you see? Actually, they share the same straight line. So, that's mean. Yeah, it's very hard for me to make you see. But I try my best. If this is 10 over here, the other one... If open bigger, it will just be four times of it. So it will become 40. Alright, so yeah. Actually, you can see something like two pieces of pizza over here. Yeah, I, I'm trying to make you see it. Yeah, do, do you see this pizza? Okay, so yeah, this one. 
is one piece of pizza here and then we have another piece of pizza i try to use uh, no yellow is not a good idea light blue okay do you see another pizza here yeah this is another one so this one actually will, will make it, make it 10 degree all right so yeah this is just the idea so yeah where am i okay so now this is 40 and this is 10 and yeah and we want to find a y we know here need to be 80 so the opposite angle i say the opposite angle must be 180 that means this angle the whole angle plus 80 need to be 180 so i can say y plus 40 plus 80 will be 180 so y is just uh okay y plus 40 plus 80 is 180 all right so y is just equals to 60. so i get my y equals to 60 i'm going to mark it down all right so okay i after i got my y i think i can get my z easily okay you see the you should be able to see this triangle over here this is 70 this is 40 110 so this one will be 70. okay so 70 70 40 40 yeah so z is just the z over here is just 180 minus 70 which is 110 yeah so you will get z equals to 110 right so yeah so over here what you need to understand is basically the art length actually uh, play a very important rule for the angle okay uh, before i end this video maybe i just give you another example because i just want to make sure you understand about the art length all right so let's say i have two art length here and then i tell you this art length is same with this art length so therefore we know that the, this angle will same with this angle i mean if this angle one this angle two i know angle one is equals to angle two Right, so if I change a little bit, I mean, yeah, I have a small art length. Okay, I tell you the art length here is x, and then the art length here is 3x. So, and then I tell you uh, maybe this is 10 degree. So, I know this one will be 30 degree. Right, this is, this is the relationship between uh, the art length and the angle. Alright, so it's just 3 times, so then you know the angle is the same thing, they will become 3 times. Alright, so yeah, I hope this short video actually can give you more idea on how to solve this kind of difficult circle question. Anyways, yeah, I hope you enjoy this video.